Hey guys, welcome to Soul Food Bowl. Today is our second edition of peanut butter series. We've made our peanut butter cheesecake previously. Now we're gonna make peanut butter burger. It was a hit, it was on a trend for a few years ago. But we are trying to recreate that dish and show you how to make peanut butter burger. It's quite simple, it's just a bun with patty and you know, fillings in it, like caramelized onions or some veggies. But today we're gonna make a tower, a burger tower. That is like a, you know, Big Mac. We're gonna layer the patties and bread and patties and bread. And one different thing is we're gonna be using sandwich bread instead of buns. Because the proclaimed first ever burger that's been made in the States was actually served with the sandwich bread rather than the bun. You can Google if you're gonna be able to find that place. So we're gonna try to do that and make our peanut butter burger. We're gonna make patty first. You know, bowl or container. Just put all your minced beef. You know, these are portion for you know making baby food. So it's quite cute, right? Some people say don't season your beef patty before you cook it because they're gonna dry out the juice or moisture from them. But today we're just gonna season it from the first. Because we're putting in some Worcestershire sauce, so you shouldn't worry about drying the meat too much. Some pepper. So when you think of peanut butter, you think of peanut, right? Of course it's made of peanut, but when you think of peanut, then you can trace it back to maybe Thailand because Thai cuisines have so much peanuts in their dish. And what do they use with peanuts? Some red pepper, of course, right? So we're gonna incorporate this crushed red pepper to give it that kind of twist to the dish, to give that flair. So you can say this is pretty much like a Thai-inspired peanut butter burger. Last but not least, Worcestershire sauce. Okay, the patties are prepared. And we'll just set them right here and we'll return to our toast. And set the toast on a pan. Some olive oil. Both front and back. Oil to the pan. In with the patties. A little bit of sugar to help the caramelization. About one pinch. Just a little bit is enough for peanut butter because you don't want that peanut butter to overpower everything. How 
am I supposed to eat this, right? <laughs> it's like a tower. Okay, um, maybe I'll just take half of it and try that. I didn't get to the patty yet. <laughs> mm. This is good. Wow. It's better than what we think and what we thought of this would be because the peanut butter is quite creamy and it matches well with the beef, the juicy beef with creamy peanut butter they complement each other with the taste and the flavor from onions all those components mixed together very well this is quite good I really want you to try this it's really really good it's better than what you think of it okay um before I finish eating this I'll have to end the video right so thanks for watching again and seeing is believing you should try this to know how it actually tastes like and I guarantee you you're not gonna be disappointed with the result just you know add peanut butter a little bit of peanut butter and that's all you gotta do with just a normal burger or sandwich I hope to see you again with another episode or a series of other cooking videos 